But farmers are not the only ones who have a role to play in reducing the flow of phosphorus from the watershed. This inexpensive and eco-friendly sewage lagoon is pioneering another nutrient reduction experiment. Sewage once flowed untreated into Lake Winnipeg, but now these storage cells are changing that. This is a type of treatment facility that's used in hundreds of municipal uh, wastewater treatment facilities across the, uh, the lake basin. We've developed a design that we can control the flow rate of the sewage uh, coming from the lagoon through the filter basin. Now these filter basins are basically uh, a combination of sands, gravels, mineral soils that we've put together and on top of that we've planted a series of native grasses and um, we're achieving uh, removal rates uh, on the order of 70 percent for nitrogen and phosphorus.